What's up everybody, this is Frank with Anabolic Outlaws A Nutrition and today I'm gonna to throw some cold hard truth bombs, all right? Here's the deal. For the most part, I remember when I used to work at the power plant, people used to always ask me in secret, hey, what do you do? What are you doing to look the way you do? And again, I've been taking testosterone replacement therapy now for years, okay? And it was almost like this dark secret that a lot of guys in my situation used to, you know, we'd, we'd take our little, you know, testosterone or whatever steroids we could get our hands on, and obviously we always looked better than a lot of the guys that were going to the gym. I think the cat's out of the bag now as to what testosterone can do for men for the most part. And I see this all the time. I see like my neighbors and things of that nature, they, they look older. They don't look the same as I do at 40, okay? They don't have any muscle tone. They've got the, 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 the belly pooch. And they look, to me, they almost look like they're 50 years old or 10 years older than they currently are. Guys, the secret is testosterone okay and you don't need to take an astronomical amount to where it's going to affect your health in a negative way in order for it to benefit you positively tremendously if you think about it like let's take a guy who's 40 okay for instance just got through a divorce you get that same 40 year old on testosterone replacement therapy you get his muscle tone up he can pass for 35, maybe even 32 years old, and that's gonna unlock the door for a lot of younger women are gonna find him attractive. That's just the way it is. But you've gotta put the work in, and you've gotta still go to the gym and work out. But I will say this, a lot of those gains that he is able to now get on that testosterone, he, he couldn't have gotten on his own naturally. All right, because your body's testosterone naturally is going to decrease dramatically after you hit age 28. I believe it goes down a percentage or two every year after that. So it's very important to get on testosterone replacement therapy. That's the secret. That's what separates all these guys that look phenomenal at the gym that are banging girls 10, 20 years younger than them from the guy who's, you know, can't get a date, who's you know, looks 10 years older than he actually is. There are things you can do to improve the way you look, all right? You, you can dye your hair, for instance. I dye my fucking hair. I'm 40 years old, right? I take testosterone, I dye my hair, and I can tell you right now, I'm probably gonna continue to do that until I'm at least age 50, but that's another 10 years from now. But for the most part, and I'm nothing to look at, I get it, but I can tell you this, I get mistaken for much younger all the time and the funny thing is when I was younger I got mistaken for being older I've been on testosterone since I was 17 years old guys cats out of the bag the first time I tried testosterone I was 17 years old I didn't know what the fuck I was doing but I can tell you right now after years of experience and actually growing up and maturing and learning how to take these performance enhancers take them safely and to where they can you can maximize their effectiveness i can tell you right now they've increased my life dramatically right if you're someone who's on performance enhancers and you've got a phenomenal looking physique and you've put in that work and you're going to get attention not just from women but from other dudes who are going to want to hang out with you want to be your friend because they know that the presence that you bring it's it's a alpha presence and that's just the side effect of testosterone replacement therapy and I know it doesn't work the same for everybody but I will say this it's a very easy fix that for most cases guys with low testosterone would never it opens doors that would never have been able to be open without the supplementation of testosterone or maybe even other performance enhancers I'm just gonna go out and say it guys now you can also take pro hormones those are things that are basically a mild version of performance enhancers but I will say this Taking performance enhancers is something that is going to benefit your life if you're taking them under a doctor's care to where they're taken um, and they're not going to damage your health, okay? Because obviously we've heard the stories about how they can, you know, they can, it's the double-edged sword, whereas obviously it can make you look a certain way, but it can also affect your health. If you've got a doctor monitoring your intake of performance enhancers, that's the best way to go about it because now you know um, you're not screwing yourself up and you can maximize and get all the benefits of the performance enhancers with very few or at least limit the side effects that you could potentially get from abusing the compounds or taking more than you need to. If you guys have any more questions, please feel free to contact me. Have a good one. Later.